Hey guys, I'm Marta Geek. In this video, I have an unboxing and hands-on look at the premium single monitor stand that I just got from, this is actually from Mount Up. I actually purchased it from Amazon. I'll leave a link in my description for that. This cost me for around 60 bucks. And I got it because I just got an ultra wide monitor and it's a gaming monitor. So it has this huge stand in the bottom and it occupies a lot of space of, from my desk, which I use it for hands-on videos and all that, right? So I want to recoup that, eliminate that and hook it up the monitor here, which I already did a video for it. I hope you actually watched it, uh, of the hands-on look of the monitor. And this will actually work for future monitors as well because you can actually put up to a 36 inch monitor, I believe. And you can hold over, I think, around 30 to 35 pounds uh, weight when it comes to the stand. So that should be good enough for any future upgrade that I want to do when it comes to a monitor. So I'm going to get this. There's a whole bunch of amount of monitors on amazon based on the reviews i decided to go ahead with this one so this has a stand right there this is actually going to be compatible with um 100 millimeters 75 millimeters and it actually says 114 millimeters as well 114 100 millimeters and 75 so if your visa is one of those it's going to fit it comes with this right here which i believe is where you're going to hook it up to the monitor comes with this right here okay this right here has this okay i believe this is one of the arms for the monitor don't know which one is it but it's one of them go throw that to the side we have this which is a plastic for what i don't know okay it looks like cable management it looks like a plastic for cable management that is good that's good to see uh what else this is the base oh and by the way this one also has uh, options to put usb-c so you can actually put usb no usb uh, ports there connect it here with the cables and hook it up to the power and have connections here you can charge your phones from there that is cool you have that option okay you have this right here which is going to be to actually attach it to the desk uh, you got screws which you're going to need you got knobs and maybe extra sports maybe i don't know this is the first time i'm actually built uh, mounting one of these these are also screws you got a couple allen wrenches and another thing right there you got this of course everything is good quality the box like you see actually said heavy and another one another allen with a screwdriver phillips on the other end included here cool and this right here which should be you know, put that to the side which should be the main part of this okay uh, let's see what it says there adjust okay this basically i believe this is like the gas portion adjust plus and negative i see that plus and negative there you go and that's it so now we're gonna go ahead and put this thing together uh, first of all, if you want to use this portion, the USB section, all you got to do is take this, these three screws off. This will come off. Then you put the cables, the USB cables through there, and the cables go out through here. Now, I'm not going to do it here in this video. I think I'm going to do it later on because I don't have the female version of those USB cables. So this is going to go like that. We're going to go ahead and put this here. Uh, should be very easy. You're going to put three screws here. And the other screws are actually going to go on the here, holding this thing right here. So with the Allen, we're going to go ahead and adjust those. There you go. So every single one is actually tight. And the other thing we want to do is use these to put it here. That way, when, um, you know, let's go ahead and put it here. That way, they don't actually scratch your desk. 
we don't want to scratch our desk so it comes with these little pads i'm gonna i'm not gonna put it on the screws because i want like i said i might want to take this out later on in the future and put the cables there but if you're not planning to put the cables there you could just put it right there as just as long as you have four of these here should be good there you go that's gonna be you know oh that's very good nice and thick there and that's gonna protect the desk from being scratched and get a better grip when you're putting it there and this either you put it here on the first two or you put it here depending how thick is the desk that you're gonna use so if your desk is over three inches you should put it over here in the bottom the last two if it's between two and a half inches just put it on the top one right there and that should be good enough to work on your desk so this is going to line it up right there that should be tight because you know it's metal versus metal it's not going to be it's not really going to damage your clamp there you go that is good enough so right there we have it all set up now we could go ahead and put it on the desk so now we got this ready we're gonna go ahead and put it here of course this is where i'm gonna put it right in the middle try that the monitor actually falls right in the middle and i'm gonna go ahead and tighten it up with the little knob in the bottom make sure it's like the way you want and put it as tight as possible because keep in mind this is going to hold your, your monitor so you don't want this to be wobbling but also don't be so exaggerated to actually break the knob and it actually comes with this nifty little cover that way you can actually lower your cables or, or run your cables through here like that and you can also cover this that way it doesn't look ugly so you go ahead and put it there and voila that looks pretty nice right there because you don't see the metal portion of the clamp you got this right here you can run the cables down like that and now we can actually put this portion this is done we can put this portion like you see it's very easy to identify this goes to the base just like that mm. okay make sure it's actually all the way down now this has a little screw right here which we want to tighten it up be careful not to tighten it up too much because you don't want this to um, to actually uh, damage the screw there that is done right there so now we're gonna go ahead and put the other portion of the arm so now we're gonna go ahead and put the second arm and like you see here in this arm this is where you're gonna have the the tension adjuster uh, so for example if it's like if the monitor is like too heavy and the arm goes going down make sure you are just the heavy to clock or uh, counterclockwise if it's like too light and the monitor is like going up you just have to go ahead and loose it up here this portion is going to go there and here is where the monitor is actually going to attach to because we're going to use this right here to hook it up to the monitor and then this is going to slide let me see it's going to slide it down like that so yeah yep so let's go and put this here just like that just like we did with the stand all the way down there you go all the way down and now we're gonna go ahead and adjust this as well just like we did with the lower arm and keep in mind just tight enough not too tight because you don't want that thing to break in there we're basically done already so we're gonna go ahead now and put the uh, this portion on the monitor so now we're gonna go ahead and put this here in the back and like I said since this is a curved screen we're supposed to use these spacers and they should make sure you line it up right there with the little hole and also make sure this goes up not down I accidentally started to put it in the wrong way and uh, since we're gonna use those spacers we're gonna use the long screws not the normal screws the long screws unless you're gonna of course put this on a flat uh, panel right now we want to go ahead and make sure they're actually put properly here so far I haven't been able haven't 
had to use my tools because this actually comes with every tool that you need like you see you got the phillips and you got the allen there so it comes with absolutely every tool that you need to put it together take a little bit more okay that is tight enough there you go so now we're ready to actually put this connected to the arm which should be done okay so here we're gonna go ahead and attach the monitor to the arm which is already assembled you might want to do this with two people two person one holding this and the other one holding the monitor i'm risking myself by doing it myself so oh look at that it's i thought it was going to be worse but it's not worse at all it's not bad at all so what you do do slide the monitor there oh don't let it go because if you let it go and the monitor the arm can't hold it it might slam like right now it is too weak so we're gonna have actually have to adjust the tension so it can actually hold it later on but now that we have it here i'm gonna go ahead and go ahead and put this screw which has to be put here so we can secure the monitor to the arm itself and there you go now once you put the screw there the monitor is never gonna fall from the arm okay so once you put that there it's totally secure we're gonna have to adjust it here and here another cool feature that this stands actually has is that you can hide once you put the cables here on the monitor you can actually run the cables through here this plastic act comes off you see that it actually comes off the other plastic over here comes off as well and you run the cables through there run it through here then you run it all the way down to your power or computer and that's it when you're done you're gonna just put it together you just slide this portion in um, just like that okay. go slide it slides in like that and this pops in back together that way the cables are actually hidden so the monitor is done this is holding it correctly this is holding it correctly over here and we can move this side by side we can adjust this if you want to adjust this a little bit up you can adjust it to make the monitor a little bit more straight i'm going to just keep it like this but of course the cool thing here is that you can move it all the way like that if you want you have all that flexibility now but now of course i'm just going to keep it here like this and like this and uh, let's see how it actually looks so we are done this actually took like less than an hour to put together uh, with the recording and all that of course it took a lot longer but honestly with the mounting and everything actually took uh, like less than an hour um, now we can have the monitor go up and down easily i got all my space back from the desk which is something one of the great reasons about these stands and of course the flexibility of having the monitor however you want to if i want to extend it forward i can if i want to put it all the way down i can that's awesome and of course i still got all my space back from the desk and that's it guys thanks for watching this video like i said i'll leave links for this mount in my video descriptions that way if you're interested in getting it you could get it honestly all i paid was 49.99 because there was a discount but this normally goes for around 60 bucks but i was lucky that i got a sale when i actually purchased this but for 60 bucks honestly is not a bad price because um i seen these arms for a lot more expensive and if you have a 34 inch ultra wide monitor that weighs around 30 pounds this should be good enough which of course that weighs a lot less than 30 pounds but yeah thanks for watching this video let me know in the comments what you think about it till next time thanks for watching Bye bye